Welcome to this episode of What's Now. I'm your host, Christine Napier. I hope you are ready to find out all of the hot topics and trends right now. And on today's show, we were talking about how to handle your winter allergies as well as help for that holiday skin. And it's a new facility for veterans and their families. But up first, I spoke with mom of three, actress and television host Vanessa Lachey, all about what she will be cooking this holiday season. Let's find out more. Hi, Christine. Hello, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm doing good. It's an honor to talk to you today. I have to admit you're one of my favorite celebrity moms to follow because you are very real and authentic and oh, big to talk to you. Thanks. So thanks for talking with us. Well, the pleasure's mine. Thank you for taking the time out. Well, yes, absolutely. So I'm here today with TV host, actress, and mom of three, Vanessa Lachey, and she's helping to launch the seventh annual Cannes Giving Sweepstakes, which encourages fans to submit their favorite original recipes for a chance to win cash prizes. Vanessa is joining us now to share some of her favorite recipes and how you can enter to win. So Vanessa, tell us all about this sweet steak. Uh, well, I am so excited to partner with Libby's Fruits and Vegetables because, as you said, this is their seventh annual Cansgiving sweepstakes. So this is a great way for everyone to share recipes, but also a chance for you to submit your recipe and win some money. So I'm encouraging everyone to use a Libby's product, their fruits and vegetables, and create or add it into a recipe you already have. Go to their website, getbacktothetable.com, and submit your recipe. And by doing that, you're entering the sweepstakes in a chance to win a cash prize. Who doesn't want extra cash during the holidays? And also, who doesn't want to learn a couple of new recipes during the holidays? I mean, good food, money, what more could you want, right? Exactly. And another great component to this is that Libby's recognizes, as do my family and I, that this is a time to not only be thankful for things and grateful, but also give back. So I'm honored to partner with Libby's because they are giving back a monetary amount as well as some of their Libby's products to Feeding America, which if you don't know what Feeding America is, it is the largest domestic hunger relief organization. And so there's definitely um, a great and real side to what Libby's is doing here this holiday season. Well, that's good to hear that they're helping out so many in need. Do you have some favorite recipes that you use Libby's for? I use Libby's for a lot of recipes because I got to be honest, I have three kids, like two, four, and seven. I I enjoy being in the kitchen and people always say, when do you find time for cooking and kids and work? You obviously have to eat and I still enjoy being in the kitchen. For me, it's my me time. I pour a glass of wine, I put on some music and I wanna make it as stress-free and simple as I can and Libby's allows me to do that by opening my pantry. I've got my stock there, take the can out, open it up and I'm ready to cook. For me at Thanksgiving, I'm a traditional girl. Like I love all the usual fixins, and what I mean by that is like the stuffing and the green bean. So I've put a fun spin on those two dishes, stuffings and green beans, and I've used some of the things that my kids love, some of the things Nick loves. Nick is a cornbread guy, and I want to put some veggies in for my kids. So my cornbread stuffing has the whole kernel sweet corn from Libby's and as well as cornbread and some herbs and it's super yummy. You can make this two days in advance, which is awesome for a busy mommy who wants to have this done prepped and in the fridge before the holidays. And then the green bean skillet, I have incorporated a crunchy topping for some texture, sun-dried tomatoes for a little punch in the, in the bite. But what I love is that I've used the French style green beans because this reminds me of being a kid for some reason, like you have those moments where you have nostalgia and whenever you can incorporate it into a new tradition, into a new dish that you're introducing into your family now, I think it's super special. And so I've taken something old and made it something new. Something borrowed, something blue. I sound like a wedding now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. It sounds delicious. I'm ready to eat it all right now. And, and both of these recipes, by the way, are on the website that I told you about, getbacktothetable.com. And also, if you go on there to submit your recipe, you can see new recipes and maybe try one. Get inspired to bring something different to your friend's house for Thanksgiving this year. Well, I definitely am feeling inspired and excited about the sweepstake, excited about the money, and also that it's giving back. It just seems like a great combination of everything that, you know, is important to us during this holiday season. Exactly. And this is why... Honestly, for me, I feel like Thanksgiving is my favorite holiday for all of those reasons you said. And it's not about the hustle and bustle and the season and travel and trying to get the presents and the gift and everything that's crazy. This is what it's supposed to be about. Family and food, the kitchen is the heart of the home, taking a minute, taking a breather. We've all been crazed with work and with life and this is kicking off that holiday season and easing into it, starting your day with the Thanksgiving Day Parade and enjoying, letting it roll into the football games 
putting your dishes into the oven, and just enjoying family and friends. It just sounds perfect. Thank you so much, Vanessa, for talking with us here at Park City Television. I encourage our viewers to head to getbacktothetable.com to learn more about everything that we've discussed today and, of course, to follow you on social media. Thank you. Absolutely. And happy Thanksgiving. Happy early Thanksgiving. Yes, you too. Thanks so much. Thanks.